Hi guys, it's Laura from Mad Mimi's Crochet and Farming, and I just got home from um, Fiber Fest La La Style. You know, I was watching um, a couple of different channels, and they were all going on a Fiber Fiber Fest in. Um, Phil, was it Philadelphia or somewhere? Um, and then in Virginia and New York and you name it, they were going everywhere. So I decided I'd go on my own little fiber fest journey. And um, the first place on my fiber fest journey was Walmart. And now I know you say that Walmart doesn't count for fiber fest, but you know what? Uh, it does to me. And uh, let me show you what I got at Walmart. Okay. It was uh, Slim Pickens. Um, I couldn't find any really cool yarn that I had to have. Um, so I did buy some Polyfill Crafters, Crafters Choice. Um, yeah, uh, all because I have to make a flippin' amigurumi for um, April's Hooker versus Hooker. So, um, there we go. This is um, my Walmart find during my uh, Fairbanks, Alaska um, Fiber Fest. It is fiber. Okay, it's not like the fiber we were thinking of, but it does have some fiber fibrous materials to it right yeah okay so there there we go on the couch and it did not fall on the floor there we go all right so now my second trip um was to michael's and yeah i know it I, michael's isn't your normal everyday fiber fiber fest tour thing the majiggy but remember i'm in fairbanks alaska and um there's not much here. <laughs> so, what did I buy at Michael's? Well, you remember me telling you that I needed a bigger one of these, right? All right. Well, and um, that I was telling you that I was waiting for them to go on sale. They were on sale the day that I went. Who knew? It was funny, though, because when I went into the section um, where they're kept... They weren't showing that they were on sale. So I was like, well, fine. I'm going to have to wait another day. But wait. I was going over in another section and I just kind of glanced. And there they were with a sign that said 40% off. And I was like, that is music to my ears. So here we go. 40% off. And that's not all. Um, they had an extra 25% off my total purchase. There we go. I can't remember what I paid for this. I, um, I don't know what I did with the receipt, but these were regularly like 50 something bucks. Like I said, four things for 50 bucks. No, I didn't think they ended up being something along the lines of like um 28 29 i can't remember if i can find the receipt i'll let you know but now that i've i've, I've filmed this i can um open this and actually put a couple of things in here so yeah 40 percent off plus an additional 25 percent yes yes Every day of my life, if I can. All right. Whoa, I better... Hmm. That's going to fall. There we go. Okay, so... What else did I get at Michael's? Well, let me show you. Well, maybe. Yeah, there we go. Maybe my receipt is in here. I don't see it. Well... That's not fiber, but this is, and now I have two of these. I figured I could make two, make something with two. And this is the loops and threads 
um, what is this called? Ombre Hughes. It's a polyester blend. Um, 5.29 ounces, 426 yards. It is a lightweight number three. 75% polyester and 25% acrylic. Now, isn't this beautiful? Yeah, yeah. And when I do make something with it, it was it's going to be for me. It does not smell good. I don't know why people smell their yarn. It doesn't smell good. So, um, it is super, super very soft, though. Yeah, so, my first real fiber. Oh, no, that's the, that uh, stuffing is fiber, too. But here we go. This is uh, a fiber. And I already bagged it up, one of them. So I, or the first one, I have to find it so I can bag it up. Now, the rest of the stuff I got... Um, is a whole bunch of the beanie thingies. Um, and that is because um, Joann's didn't have very many uh, the last time I went. So when I was, you know, checking out, I saw that they were tons and tons of them at Michael's. So here we go. Um, I'm just going to put all of them. I'm going to put all of them in the Joanne bag. So uh, let's see what we got. Oh, look at the cute little puppy. His name is Noodles. Isn't he cute? All righty. There's one. There's Noodles. And I got one, two, three, I think, of a Marvel character. Who is this? Um, I don't know. Black Panther. So, yes, I got three of the Black Panther dude. There we go. Yepper, yeppers. I'm going to keep one of them out because I'm going to ask you something. And I got, let's see. Um... One, two, three. Uh, one, two, three, four. Spider Man's. Spider Men's. So there we go. I got four of those. Okay, what else did I get? Oh. I got two of these. Uh, who is this? Mm, this little. Looks like a fox to me. The little fox name is Meadow. And I got two. Well, of course, because they're orange. Hello. Okay, so there's that. Um, I got this kind of looking calico giraffe. Its name is... Stilts. So there we go. There's stilts. Okay. There we go. I got this little puppy dog, it looks like, whose name is, well, maybe, Spirit. Here is Spirit. He's cute. And this cute little kitty cat is Fiona. I wouldn't have named it Fiona, but that's me. All right. So Spirit and Fiona. All righty. And um, I found a turtle. Look, Linan, you might like this. And its name is Turbo. I don't think so. They're not very fast. So there's Turbo. Kind of Soylent Green looking, isn't it? Okay. And and I think these are dragons because they have wings. The green one is named Cinder. 
Is this one named Ella? Ah. Okay, come on, come on. Okay, Cinder and Sapphire. This one is Cinder. It is cute, even though it's green. And this one is Sapphire. This one's cuter. Okay, alrighty, I'm done playing. So, those are all of the animals that I got. And those will keep me busy for quite a while. So, um... Well, I did get some fiber from uh, from Walmart, the stuffing, and this one yarn right here. So, wow, you know, I I had to, I just had to be careful because I was on a serious budget. So there's that, um, and then of course I got all of those those um, beanies. They're made out of fiber, so there we go. Um, I'm gonna keep that with here. Okay. So then I went to um, Joanne and um, Joanne, um, I did have to pick up some um, other stuff from Joanne. So um, I did pick up three each of um, this Varsity Yellow and Orange Bright. And that is to go with a blanket that I will be making in the future. Um, I have three, five. I have five of each of these, but I it's, and I also have a, um, a variegated one that goes with both of these. So um, I still might not have enough. Excuse me, but um, I can always go and get some more. I don't see, I put that one up because I'm not going to start, start it yet, but it's our Zoom, um, uh, Zoom sister blanket. We each picked a stitch, um, Mama Swift, um, tested it out and now we have to test it out and it could be that, um, Mama Swift, um, writes the pattern up and then sells it later at a later date. So we are not allowed to disclose the, um, the stitches that are in it, but there's 19, 20, 19 or 20 different stitches in the blanket. All right. So I got three, each of these, it's a big twist, hundred percent acrylic, um, six ounces, 380 yards in bright orange and varsity yellow. So there we go of that. Uh, I need to find out where I put that other one. So, whoops, let's put that there, because I do have a bag already where those are, and I just have to find it. It's around here somewhere. <laughs> it's the story of my life. Okay, so the last thing I did is I got two of these. Um, and I was thinking when I saw them because they were on sale, I can't remember how much these were. Um, the, uh, the big twist was on sale for $2. Uh, they were on sale for $2.99. But I had 25% um, off and then an additional 15% for a military discount. Um, so, yeah, I thought these were on sale, but I only got the 15% off mil or the 25% off. And then the 15%. So these ended up, instead of being $7.19, these were $4.58. I guess I should have looked a little bit harder. I wouldn't have spent $4 for these. So what is that? That's uh, eight, uh, nine, $9. I wouldn't have spent $9 for the both of them. But that's all right. Um, it is the Lion Brand 
um, basic stitch anti-pilling. And it's three ounces, 153 yards. And this color is called black white. Duh. All righty. Now I got this because I thought that I could make the lovey out of this. Or was that too much black? I don't know. I kind of like it. And I got two because I think I got either three or four. And I could probably get them all of get all of them made and maybe have some extra left over. So uh, what do you think? Can those two go together or is that too much? Well, I think I'm going to put them together anyway. But um, I don't know. I kind of like those two together. Yeah, so there's those. Okay, so I, I'm, I do have that set aside, even if you guys don't like it. <laughs> okay, so now I did go to my, um, to my local yarn store. And, uh, okay, you're deep in the jungle, hanging the Hope, please. <laughs> I'm back. All righty. Um, so, local yarn store. I have already bought all that I can from the local yarn store. I showed you guys that, and, and it's for a particular hat, so I won't show it again. Um, but, yeah. How do you guys like my uh, tour of Fairbanks Fiber Fest? Isn't it great? I know I could have taken you guys along, but um, yeah, it, it, it wasn't that much fun, to be honest with you. Yeah, so um, I do have um, two Happy Mails um, and um, I, ooh, I'll add this into my Fiber Fest tour because I bought this and it came in the mail same day I did the tour. So, um, I bought this bag from Ella from uh, No Catchy Name. Um, I've been missing out on her bags, but I don't use bags a lot anymore um, because the cats just get, you know, they'll find one and they'll sit on it and then... You know, it's full of hair. So, um, I got this bag. And if you guys know me, you guys know that I am an Otis fan through and through. So, here I did. I got it. I call it my Otis bag. Isn't this a very handsome brown bear? Yeah, I think, I think it even looks a little bit like Otis. I think they all look like Otis. So yes, I did purchase this from Ella from No Catchy Name. And here is my Otis bag. I know you're going to be jealous, Jan, but there was only one. Yeah. So here's my Otis bag. And I'm going to use this um, just for kind of everyday stuff, going to the grocery store. You know, I use these bags for the grocery store, but I'll probably use these um, or use this one for um, other stuff because I didn't want I don't want it to get all dirty and stuff because it's all nice and fluffy right now. So, yes, this is my Ella bag. Um, I can't wait to see if Otis makes it back this year. He is the oldest bear in the cat my that is known oldest bear known in Katmai um, National Park. And um, they will be coming online um, pretty soon to uh, that we can, you know, start bear watching. Uh, typically for the last couple of years, uh, Otis has returned on Emily's birthday. So I'm always looking out on her birthday, it is very late in the season, but um, he is also very, very old. So, um, not sure if he's going to make it make it back, but that's all right. All right. So um, that is all that I have from my Fiber Fest of um, Fairbanks and the North Pole Post Office. <laughs> 
<laughs> so um, thank you guys for watching. Thank you, Ella, for this bag. Um, I'm going to hang it up right here because I don't want the cats to get it all dirty. So um, there's my Otis bag. That looks like Otis right there. So um, I get carried away with Otis. All right, so that's it. I will get these happy mails. Um, I'm just going to say, Kristen, um, one of them is yours, and the other one I already told that um, that that it's from or that I received it. And they are eggs. So um, I might just put them up here so they'll go in order um, also. So... Um, so here's one right here. And then here's um, the other right here. <laughs> no, they don't sound like anything. Okay. Oh, let's have a scarf of the day also. Okay. So you guys know that I bought this um, Red Heart Super Saver. And um, now it doesn't, this one skein, it does not make a very big one, but it does make one. Um, it's five ounces, 236 yards, and the color is camouflage. And, um, excuse me, and this is what, this is what I have left right there. Not a lot. That's going to go in my um, my jar that is holding um, fluff. So now it can stretch out, but it does look small, but it can go for a kid or somebody can wear it just like this to cover up their neck and get it inside their coat. So um, it is small, but... It will still do the trick. So, um, now I am closing. I'm going to go put this in my computer and um, put this down there with uh, the rest of them. I do have another scarf of the day um, up there. And I have about eight more in here that I can make with the stuff that I have found so far. So... Um, now I am headed out. So with that in mind, um, thank you to all of my new subscribers for being here. Thank you, um, to all of my continued supporters of allowing me to be a dork, um, to be a mad Mimi and to just do weird things. You know, it's weird. Being weird is fun. Um, I will I will be coming on and telling you some news about something that I'm going to be starting pretty soon. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, I can't believe I'm going to do it either. But, you know, hey, it's all right. Um, I was... Uh, okay, so I, I won't say that. Um, where was I going with this? I don't know where I was going. Oh, I was going with, I'm going to see you guys later. So thanks guys for watching. If you wouldn't mind, um, down below in the description box is a link to light a candle for both my daughter and my granddaughter. If you wouldn't mind lighting a candle for them, I would very much appreciate it. So now I bid you adieu. Thank you guys for watching. You guys have a great day, and I will talk to you next time. Bye-bye.